Welcome to the next episode of Pajama Drama. Welcome back. Today I'm talking about three huge benefits of wearing the same thing every day. Ew, David, why would I do that? I know at first you're probably thinking, I don't wanna wear the same thing every day. One, that's gross. Two, that's boring. Three, why? There are a few successful people in our culture that have adopted this habit and it's worked out pretty well for them. The first one is Steve Jobs. He always wore a black turtleneck, jeans and sneakers. Barack Obama was always wearing a gray or blue suit. Mark Zuckerberg, gray t-shirt and a hoodie. And Michael Kors, black jacket, black shirt, jeans. Every day. First, I'm gonna explain the three huge benefits of possibly adopting this new way of wearing clothes. And secondly, I'm gonna explain some options on how to make this your own and make it work for you. The first reason to adopt wearing the same thing or kind of thing every day is it will save you a ton of time. A ton of time over a period of a year. Let's say it takes you five minutes to decide what to wear. Five minutes a day times seven is 35 minutes a day. Over a period of 52 weeks, that will be 30 hours of your year you spent simply on that one decision on what to wear. Now, some of you, five minutes is nothing. Let's talk about those of you that it takes 10 minutes. That's double, that's 60 hours of your year you've spent on that one decision every single day trying to decide what to wear. And there's still some of you that take even longer than that. I'm thinking when we put it that way, you might think there is other things that you wanna do with that 30 to 60 hours of your life during the year that might be more valuable than deciding on what to wear. The second huge benefit of wearing the same thing every day, knowing what you're wearing without having to think about it, it's automatic, is it cuts down on decision fatigue. What is decision fatigue? The deteriorating quality of decisions made by an individual after a long, series of decision making. So in short, the more decisions you make throughout the day, the probability of your quality of decision making, it's getting worse as the day goes on. The more decisions you make, the more tired you're getting. So if you make two big decisions easier earlier in the day, what you're gonna wear and what you're gonna eat, that cuts back on a lot of thinking about it. I think the same kind of thing applies to eating right? What am I going to make? What are we going to eat? What are we going to order? Whatever you do, it's a lot of time thinking about what you're going to make and what you're going to eat. Same thing with clothes. What am I going to wear? If you can simplify those decisions, you're going to save a ton of time and you are going to cut back on your decision fatigue exponentially. The third big benefit of wearing the same thing every day, if you're not having to have your closet stuffed full of stuff that you're not wearing, it's gonna save you a ton of money, right? I am not a fashionista by any means, so it's not something I value more than other people that really take great pride in what they wear every day. I'm more of a simple kind of gal. Just think about if you were not into having dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens of outfits, how much that would save you financially if you could pare it down to only the things that look really great on you and that you love wearing. This is intriguing, but how do I make this work for me? I'm so glad you asked, little clone of me. Okay, here is an example of how you can make this work for you where if you don't wanna actually wear the exact same thing every single day. Now, you can either wear the same thing every day if you have a look that really becomes your signature look, you can do that. You can literally wear the same shirt and wash it frequently, or you can get seven or eight of the same shirt. Here's a little uniform formula that worked for me in a little bit more of the warmer months here in Maine, but this is something that I think could work for you if it resonates anyway. This is a shirt that I got at Kohl's, okay? And it's a pullover shirt. So underneath it, I would wear on the bottom, I'd wear black pants or jeans if you wanted, black pants or jeans, my standard. And then I had a, like a solid cami underneath. That was my 
my my base cami jeans or black pants and whatever shoes you want but this shirt became my signature shirt for a while and i got it in five different colors so the first one is you see how it's it's just a popover shirt so easy it's vera wang size large you could just literally throw it over anything and so i had it in purple loved it so much i got it in black loved it so much i got it in blue loved it so much i got it in gray loved it so much i tried a pattern for the record i don't really care for patterns very much for my normal everyday work clothes i prefer solid colors but you get the point i got the exact same shirt in five different patterns, colors that I loved wearing. And then what I would do is I would just kind of accessorize it a little differently every day, right? So I either would switch up the jeans or the pants and then I would sometimes add a scarf to it. Someday I would add a blazer to it. I'd add a little cardigan to it. I was wearing the same shirt every single day and do you know who noticed? No one. You know why? Because nobody cares what you're wearing. Everyone's so concerned with what they're wearing. They're not analyzing your outfit. Unless you work on like the show Selling Sunset, in which case people care. But if you're just going to work every day, most people are not analyzing your clothing. It's just you. So that's an example of how it wasn't exactly the same thing I'm wearing every day. Not the exact same thing, but a style that was feeling flattering and comfortable and professional for me every single day. And I just made that work. And I knew every single day I was just pulling out the next color. I'd wash it on the weekends and then I accessorize it differently. Hair up, hair down, different earrings. You can make it look completely different. So really like that shirt, I could have had just all of them in black and made it look different every single day. Or if you don't like the same exact color, get that same shirt just get it in different shades if that's the look that you prefer and you think you look great you feel confident in make it work let me know in the comments do you have a uniform that works for you please let us know your formula or your look down in the comments so maybe it'll give us some ideas if you came here because you like frugal living minimalism budgeting saving money you're in the right place please hit subscribe and smash that thumbs up it really helps my channel and you will be notified if you hit that bell each time I upload. Let's be honest. I know some of you only come to see buns. So here he is. Say hey K-Squad. Hey K-Squad. Mwah. Mwah. We love you guys. If you like this kind of content, I'll leave a video here and here that you can check out next to continue on in this journey of minimalism and frugal living. Thank you for joining me in this episode of Pajama Drama. See you next time.